Hello, tacticians and strategists, fleet commanders and viper pilots. Welcome back to Battlestar Galactica Deadlock and playing hardball. It is Wilbert's turn. And well, that will be a quick mop up, hopefully. We just need to defend Caprica from a little incursion, most likely by a Cylon detachment that tries to scan the area. And that will look for some uh, worthwhile targets, I guess. Yeah. Well, the big question is like, if the Colonials would send someone who gets a ship shot up uh, directly to, co to court martial, uh, that is actually an interesting question. Um, but I actually don't think so. Like, not if, not if uh, it, you know, unless it was totally reckless, but... Uh, our video titles, that's more the yellow press, you know, the Capricorn or Piconian yellow uh, press. Journalists trying to make some headlines. So there we go. Do we have anything? The Vipers cost something, the armor piercer, yeah, we don't need any armor piercers here. Guided missiles there, that reduces the costs, very nice, let's proceed. Wilbert. However, I mean, there's certainly some form of investigation, I guess, yeah, and um, emission debriefing. Understood. They came from behind, these guys. Understood. I like so, and actually, we could probably already identify them if they fly in the right direction. So say we all. You guys. This actually, yeah, well, no, it's fine. Do like that. And those battle stars. Yes, sir. Launch all squadrons, frigates. Launch all squadrons. Yeah, and thanks to Hanpack for the, uh, for pointing out the standard fleet composition for a seven thousand point fleet. And that's actually interesting. Well, I would also think that. Um, what did you say? Like five, uh, five adamants and two battle stars. So that's like a nice concentration of vipers. But I personally, I really, I really like to have a manticore around, um, because it gives us some additional firepower, and is also excellent bait usually. But of course, it comes with the risk. That's clear. Basically, everybody can go on. Offensive mode, all weapon stations manned, all energy to weapon systems. You guys shoot there. Are we already? Yeah, they are already in. No, they are not in range, but they will be. So here. Shooting there. Artemis. Coming about. Oh, yeah. Well. We are shooting at this guy, focusing fire, our frigates come along like so, well this one will most likely fly around I guess, well, let's, let's shoot at, at this one, the Karakoram boosts forward. Shoots at that one as well. What kind of satellite do we have here? CIC subsystem strength. That's actually nice but irrelevant. Although, I mean, let's try and get higher, but uh, I, I don't think we are getting there before we are destroying them. You focus fire there. Let's have three Vipers. Defend here and four go on the offensive. Oh, actually, that was not smart because the the guys who are in the back. Yeah, let's have them actually defend that location, and then we put the three forward ones. So you guys defend here. 
And you three attack this one. Understood. There. You Manticore shoot missiles at this one. Karakoram also shoots missiles at that one. All three adamants shoot missiles at that one and the ranger. Let's finish off this guy on the flank as quickly as possible. There. So. The hoaxer. Our glorious hoaxer. Do we have any planets? There, there's one. Ah, oh, yeah, well. Let's, let's watch from here. Ending the turn. Yeah, nice. Very good starting to shoot. Very good. Actually, it appears we have surprised the Cylons there. Very nice. Manticore. Presenting rear turrets. And actually, no, actually we are flying high. Yes, sir. Yeah, although really the... Uh, you shoot at this one. <laughs> the um, satellite is irrelevant. Let's fly a bit lower. Focusing fire at that one. You guys, fly forward like so. Keep this one in your crosshairs. Ranger. Now the missiles can possibly be enough. But you can rather shoot at this one. And our Artemis as well. On it, Commander. Focus fire. Let's, let's see uh, if the missiles destroy them. So this one should be gone. But I think they are actually going to launch their missiles. So you three Vipers. Four Vipers, actually. Now let's have two of you defend here. And you two defend here. Yeah. And you guys, you still attack them there. Ending the turn. Very nice. Yep, they are shooting their missiles. Very good. But we are already intercepting. Da they are very nice. Very nice. Double kill. Missiles and incoming. Triple kill. Very nice. Very nice indeed. The ma Our Manticore. Perseus, brace for impact. The Vipers, well, they are on their way, but they, well, it was too much for them. Brace for impact. Oh, yeah, and we nearly. Oh, wow, it was nearly a quadruple kill. We've never had that one before. That was a close one. That would have been a record. You Vipers, if you can, try to defend the Perseus and you others. You're messing this one up, it's fine. They, I think they will they will only survive for a split second. Also, no, there's already there's already artillery coming in, so I guess they are actually uh, going to be sent to toaster hell quickly enough. Focus fire there. And in return. Yeah. Good. Very nice indeed. Very nice indeed. There was a quick one. Even quicker than I thought. Well, Wilbert wants to produce some better headlines. Let's do the replay. And speaking of journalists, so sorry uh, that I didn't uh, produce a, a, an episode yesterday. I had a sort of tunnel vision because I was uh, working on my first movie review. Um, but I have struggles with the software. Yeah? So And then suddenly there was no sound in some parts of the clips and horrible, horrible. And I'm still working on it to overcome it. I hope that I will finish it today. 
So there, double. The second one. Oh no, actually, that was so quick. That was all so quick, we just messed them up completely. Let's have, a, let's have another look. That went so quickly. So, turning around, hmm. Who's coming from behind there? Trying to poke us in our botox. There, open fire, all missiles. In the sky, vipers out. Yeah, the, I think the the spread of fire worked out nicely this time, and I think they even they weren't even able to launch all their missiles there. Like just judging from the sound, very nice, very nice indeed. Nice explosion and uh, destruction of that one. That nemesis there. Well, well, very nice. So let's proceed. Yeah. So, and the next one, that will be Davis's turn, and he needs to, yeah, he's hunting Cylons at Persephone, but we are wearing them down, or we have a stronger fleet against the last remnant, so, yep, the red forest is thinning out, however, do we, are we here? It's Tauron, no, it's not Tauron, right? Well, we need to hunt them over there. But we know that uh, we do have an increase uh, in the colony morale, so that's the good thing. Still, we are d we are still beyond 400 tillium though, which is not so good. We are even there. Well, but we'll see. So we are continuing the next episode and then it will it will be Davis's honor to send some toasters to toaster hell. Thank you for watching guys. I hope you like this one. We were close to a new record. Four kills in one turn. But closely missed is also missed, right? So anyway, if you have any thoughts on that one, please do share them. You know you're always welcome. And I would appreciate it if you click the like button, if you liked anything at all about this little endeavor here. You know it helps with the channel a lot. And I would also appreciate it if you subscribe if you haven't done so yet, so you never ever miss an episode again. And don't forget it is completely free. See you next time. Bye bye.